Hey, y'all. Welcome. Welcome back to Artistic License, my Sunday steamer. We do a little bit of whatever I want. We're on part two. It's time now to play some Sims 2 Pleasant View. So let's just jump right into it. So um, I realized that uh, probably next round when we get around to what's going on with Dina and Mortimer, that that's probably going to be the last time we see Mortimer. So to prepare for that, I went ahead and moved Malcolm Landgrab from the business district over to here. And I also put Club Dante, which he owns, as well as the Electronic Super Center. I moved those over to Pleasant View from the sub hood. Now, I know what you have probably heard. Do not move these. Okay, do not move people around different neighborhoods. If it's from a sub hood to a regular hood, it's going to be fine. Okay, what you shouldn't do is move people from um, like Pleasant View to Strange Town or whatever. And it's because of how it creates these stub records for your Sims. Um, and then you end up with more Sims than the neighborhood can handle, especially on a Mac, then it craps out. So anyway, <clears throat> it's totally fine. What I did is totally fine because all of those stubs still existed. Okay, because it was just from a sub hood into here. Um, so we have right here, Daniel living here. And remember he started dating Kaylin. He started dating Kaylin at the end of the last time that we met him. Oh, I forgot my water. I've got my pepper. I got my peppermint tea, but I forgot my water. It's sitting on the counter. I'll go grab it in a second. Come on, open. Open this without like spilling the hot water everywhere. It's got like a seal. Ah, there we go. Okay, I can get the tea bag out of this. <clears throat> All right, so here's Daniel in his condo. This is um where Don Lothario used to live. He moved into Don's old condo. And uh, <laughs> you can see he's got public woo who want that's probably from, you know, Kaylin. He wants to make a friend. Um, he and Kaylin, you can see they are engaged. So uh, so they're going to end up getting married. They're going to end up getting married. Let's get them a little wedding arch. Every um, house in The Sims needs a little wedding arch so that you can get married all cute. OK, so we're going to do that. Let's do let's do the red one. Let's do the red one for him. I think that's good. All right. <clears throat> All right. Okay, Daniel. So you want to make a friend, earn some money, charisma skill point, mechanical skill point, and creativity skill point. What do you need? You need mechanical and charisma. So you can definitely come work on your charisma. I think you would do that right now. Oh, shoot. It re-rolled. It re-rolled. What's it going to re-roll? Oh, no. He still wants... Okay. The same. That's exactly what it had a second ago. It's exactly what it had a second ago. So you can see since he moved out, he doesn't have family friends anymore. Okay, all of his friends were actually Mary Sue's friends. So uh, so that's cool for him. You can see they had a really good date last time because there's Kaylin. There's Kaylin delivering the roses. Um, let's put those up in the house somewhere fun. He not, oh, he can't, I bet he can't pick them up until Kaylin leaves the lot. Okay. So they had a dream date. They're engaged now because um, the way I play Daniel, hey, Lindsay, um, the way I play Daniel is he is a serial monogamist. <coughs> He's a serial monogamist. So um, so he wants to just straight up just get married again to uh, to Kaylin, even though he literally just got divorced and Kaylin's the reason he got divorced. Whatever. It's not going to happen this time. This time it's going to go great. OK, this time it's going to go great. No problems. He wants to buy a green energy source, curtains, and gain a mechanical skill point. Okay. <clears throat> Why don't you study mechanical? Stop with your charisma. Study mechanical. All right, let's put this up in the bedroom. Um, I guess it can just go, just go right here for now. Um, let's get another table. Another table. Put the roses on them. There. <clears throat> A symbol of our love. My love, Kaylin, the maid. Hopefully, he'll roll some wants that will um, prompt us to kind of like calling Kaylin and getting her over here to get married. Because I do want to get them married this round and have her move in. Um, you know, so that she can, 
she can get started with her new life with him. Oh wait, there she is. What's she doing? Why is she sneaky? Kaylin, what are you doing? What? Why? What? I had a ridiculously fun time. I thought I'd commemorate the event with a hot tub. He already has a hot tub, but Kaylin, that's amazing. Oh my god, he has two hot tubs now. Okay, wait. Okay. Um, well, we have to get rid of this hot tub, obviously, and use the one that Kaylin gave us. Because, like, what the heck? That's true love. True love is hot tubs. So there we go. We got a brand new hot tub. That's nice. <laughs> All right, why don't you open this? Buy a ceiling fan? Why? why? why what is your... Is it pleasure? Is it because you have um, pleasure secondary aspiration? No, you have fortune secondary aspiration. Why are you rolling those type of wants? Okay, stop, stop studying. <clears throat> he still has his job, so he's going to earn some money. Like, it's going to be fine. to buy a curtain gosh i guess you can buy these things like i that's fine i mean that's fine uh let's see where are curtains decorations what are you, what are you doing back there wasn't a ruckus okay, he wants to buy some curtains i guess like we can do that i almost never buy curtains for their windows i just don't you know i just don't but i guess we could buy like these for the kitchen. Oh, that's a really big, that's a big window. Those are, that's a big, these fit? Do any of the curtains fit on these big ass windows? No, not really. These are for long windows. Oh, I guess these fit. What colors do I have for these? Is this the only color? Is the only color I can do? I mean, I guess it kind of matches. Okay, whatever, we'll get some curtains. There, you can have some curtains for your kitchen. Hi, Oreo, what's up? Does everybody want to say hi to Oreo? Oreo, come here. Good boy. Oh, you don't visit stream very much. He's so big, you guys, he's gotten so big. This Oreo, hello. I know, you don't like to be held. I know, boy. There you go, sorry. He does not like to be picked up. All right. <clears throat> yes, okay, so we can get rid of this computer. And let's put out that humble computer instead. All right. Oh, he's really hungry. Why don't you... Ooh. Why don't you have some cereal? What is this other stuff? He wants to buy a ceiling fan and a green energy source. Okay. He's already got nice light fixtures there. A little light fixtures there. He probably should have a ceiling fan in his living room. I never put up ceiling fans either, even though they're essential in like real life. They're going to be under decoration somewhere, right? I bet they're, oh, I bet they're under, oh wait, no, there's a ceiling fan. Yeah. Yeah, there we go. Let's put one right over the couch. There we go. <clears throat> oh, he wants to get back with Mary Sue. Daniel, that's not happening. She's moved the fuck on. She's moved the fuck on. Should we have him call her in the morning, though? Maybe we should. Maybe we should have him call. See what happens. That's what he's wanting. That's what he's wanting. That wasn't enough food. Why don't you have some more cereal? Yeah, it's okay to eat two bowls of cereal. Okay, now you should probably get your fun up. Watch some TV. Gosh, his social is really low too. But he does want to make a friend. All right, does he have to work today? He does not have to work today. 
All right, you have the day off today, so why don't you give Mary Sue a call? Let's see how this goes. Let's see how this goes. Uh, he's so angry at her, and yet he wants to. Uh, he wants to talk. <coughs> see how this goes. Ah! Oh, wow. Oh my gosh, he's not mad at her anymore. Did he just apologize? I think he just called her to apologize. She has moved on, my friend. She's remarried. She's got a whole new life. Like I don't, I, she's not, she's not straight anymore. Like I don't know what to tell you. She's not straight anymore. Okay, he wants to go buy new clothes. Yes, we can do that after he finishes talking to Mary Sue. Mm. We're gonna go buy some clothes. All right. Um, food reading, reading at the bookstore, shop till you drop. We want to go there. <clears throat> Poor Daniel. Poor Daniel. So many struggles. We gotta get Kaylin moved in. So he needs to roll some wants or he needs to see her while he's shopping. Like, we might just have to like force it. Because I want them married. That's the story that we're going for. He's gonna buy he's gonna buy some new PJs. Oh, he wants to slow dance with Sim. Okay. Let's unlock that public woohoo and let's do that. And maybe we're that's gonna be our we're gonna call Kaylin for the slow dance. And uh and we're gonna use that. Maybe if he sees her again, he'll wanna get married. <clears throat> he has fears of having a bad conversation and be rejected. Oh my gosh. Daniel, she moved the fuck on. She moved the fuck on. It can't happen. And it's not her fault, you know? It's not her fault. You opened her eyes. She's, uh, she's not straight. I know she had two kids with you, but, like, she didn't know any better. Okay, so he wants to buy some new jammies. What would he, what would he want? He's got these. I think he wants, um... He wants something a little bit more like he doesn't have any kids anymore. I think he wants like this. Yeah. Oh, she thinks he's hot. Thank you, random townie. <clears throat> oh, man. Asks him out on a date. Okay. It's, I know you want Mary Sue. I know you do, but it's not happening. Let's see. Let's go home. You bought some clothes. Now you can go home. Poor Daniel. I guess that Mary Sue didn't tell him on the phone about how uh, she remarried. You know, I guess she didn't say anything. I feel like the developers really do want you to get Daniel and Mary Sue back together, but I don't ever do that. Never, ever. Daniel goes with Kaylin. <clears throat> That's right. Not happening, Heritage Nomad. All right. We are going to call Ask on Date for our, for our wedding. All right, come on, Kaylin. Home, come here. That's right. And why don't you take a little nap before she gets here? Because you're pretty tired. Okay, so she's here. 
What is she doing? Okay, you need to wake up. You need to talk to her. I'm gonna change him into formal clothes. She's talking about the dream date they had. That play, pillow fight, dance, and dirty jokes. Oh, why negative? I don't know what happened. Um, let's do a pillow fight. <coughs> <laughs> Let's do a dance. Switch as you Tell Mato. Oh, I did classic dance instead of slow dance. Where's the slow dance? Slow dance. We'll make out first. It's fine. Oh, I guess he's bad at the dance. Well, he's still got the make out one. That's interesting. Oh, he's getting make out with three sims. Oh my gosh. Okay, they both have woohoo want. We can definitely fulfill that. Alright, go relax. We're gonna do the woohoo one. Come on, join me, Kaylin. This is what I invited you over here for. Oh, no! Where are you going, girl? Girl, where are you going? I did do the ask to join. Ask Kaylin to join. Come on. There we go. I'm back. I'm back. John Shabbat. All right, now it's a dream date. Come on, roll some wants for marriage or don't. <clears throat> You don't need to sleep. You don't need to sleep. We're going to have to force it. He's not going to roll the wand. He's not going to roll the marriage. He's got fears getting married. And she doesn't have the wand at all. Oh my gosh. This is just craziness. He's still so hung up. He's still so hung up on Mary Sue. What are y'all doing? Is this ACR time? Yeah, okay, they're doing it on their own. Once wasn't enough. Time to go again. <laughs> I understand, Daniel. I understand. She's good. Come on, let's see if we can roll a want for getting married for either of them. Um, let's do a make out. Do a hug. Oh. <laughs> Oh, wait a second. I have a dream date. Oh, there we go. Yay, she wants to get married. Okay. Um, Let's do it. Let's do a change into 
formal. And we'll do propose. We'll do propose move in so we can get control of her. And then we'll do the marriage. Yes, she's moving in. Oh, it meant she re-rolled. That's fine. It's fine. It's fine. We saw the want. Okay, it still counts. It still counts. Why don't you change into formal, Kaylin? And then, since you're the one that rolled the want, we're gonna do get married from you. Look at her. Look at her formal outfit. It's so pretty. She's like such a classy lady. But she gets involved with with uh with Mr. Pleasant. She gets involved with Don Lothario. Like you know, she has all these issues, but she's like, in her heart, so classy. <clears throat> Here we go. Go down. He's so pretty. So pretty. She's everyone's goth girlfriend. Ibsen. The Quinto. Ajini. Oji. Fondace. Uva tavola. Mmm. Esti. Grando. Yep. <laughs> Choose the last name for this couple. Okay, we want them to be pleasant. Oh, and he's so, he's like, no, I'm married again. No. No. <laughs> All right, let's end the date. Let's end the date. Yep, that was an awesome date. Okay, she wants to have a baby. Okay, she wants to have a baby. Now, because of her, like, if you go and look at her, um, not this. Yeah, her hobby enthusiasm. Um, based on that, I have a little calculator that I use from Pleasant Sims and then based on her interests as well. You can see she has very high paranormal interests. Now that she's stable and married, to me, I think that she wants to like start a new job. Okay. So I like to put her in the paranormal track for um for this. So we're gonna serve dinner. Let's serve some pork chops. All right, you y'all are both okay. Let's take care of your needs before we fuck around anymore. Let's keep. Let's lock those. Let's lock that so we can make it happen pretty easily. <clears throat> oh, we need another chair because there's two of them now. We need another chair. Here we go. Why don't you sit down and hang out with her while she cooks? Well, they she's gonna have to make them in the microwave because there's no oven. Oh my gosh, they've got to move to a better house if they're gonna start a family. Ah oh, shit, she is super high cooking. Why? Why did you burn the pork chops? Is it because it's the microwave? No, don't serve that shit. Try again. Let's try again. Daniel, you can come clean this up. There we go. There we go. They're not ruined this time. They're actually edible. <clears throat> All right, Daniel, eat your food. There we go. Now he can put away leftovers. <laughs> then go take a shower. Now her bladder is really bad. She needs to use the toilet. Will she still do it when he's in the shower? Yes, she will. Okay, fantastic. All right. <clears throat> she wants to adopt a kitten, meet someone new, take a vacation, have a bibbit. Ahem. <clears throat> 
<clears throat> All right, and let's recycle this. Why don't we take this and put it in her inventory? Gosh, they're definitely going to have to move because there's no way. Like, where would a kid even go here? This isn't even like the Calientes one where it's like you could kind of see it. Okay, so we are going to have her walk to Lot. We're going to have her go. No, Daniel doesn't need to go with her. Let's see. All right, she's married now. She wants a real job. She doesn't want to be a maid anymore. She's going to pursue her real passion, which is the paranormal, all right, by taking a paranormal career. You know, we were talking about people. I have a lot of Aquarius friends earlier. Kaylin's also an Aquarius. Paranormal. Ooh. Uh, we're going to take that job. Yes. Uh, okay. Not a scope. You can go home. I wonder what house we should move them into. I mean... Since Kaylin moved in, they got a decent amount of money. We can move them somewhere nice. <clears throat> oh, look at their picture. They're so cute. They're so cute. Look at them. Aw. All right. How's Daniel doing? Just watching TV. Yeah, I know you love sports. Okay, Kaylin's home. All right, you guys should probably go to bed. <clears throat> you know, Kaylin needs to buy some uh, new clothes, too. Needs to buy some new clothes, too. She's not sleepy enough. Let her energy dip. She can do whatever she wants. Yeah, you can watch TV. It's fine. Let her energy dip a bit until she'll actually sleep, and then we'll have her go to sleep, too. Got to get to halfway. There we go. Now she'll sleep. What she want to do? She wants to write a novel or read a novel. Okay. Let's have her read a mystery. I think with the paranormal stuff, she would like that. Why didn't she read it? Read a book. I guess you can write in your diary. What are you trying to do, Daniel? Oh, flirt. Okay, stop writing in your diary. Your husband wants to flirt with you. Maybe a sci-fi book she'll read it? I don't know why she stopped the, re the action. <clears throat> yeah, she's not doing it. I don't know. I don't know what's going on. Um, I don't know. But she can talk about her hobbies. Let's see. Talk about hobby. Um, let's talk about sports. Daniel loves sports. 
Did either of them work today? He's off today. She is not off today. She works at night time. Okay, now she wants to classic dance with Dan. Wants to learn fire prevention and learn anger management. Okay, we can do that. Daniel, does Daniel still have any interesting wants? No, he wants to woohoo. We can do that. Not really. Let's study fire safety. Maybe then they can buy a stove because she learned fire safety. That's working for her. I don't know why reading the novel didn't work for her. He wants to meet someone new. I guess we can have him hang out outside and meet someone new. You should probably put on some clothes first. Put on your clothes, Daniel. And come greet the mailman. Say hi. Now he wants to make a friend and earn money. All right, who's he got good relationships with? I guess he doesn't have any relationship anymore with his kids. Why don't you call your kids and try to make friends with them? Lilith is out in class. Oh. <laughs> um, let's see if his other daughter's in class, if it's going to say the same thing. Yeah, she's in class. Oh my gosh. Oh, and Nina said it. Ah! So now he knows, like, what's she doing over there? All right, well, who else? Who else does he have that he could call? Um, I guess he could call the Burbs. Why don't you talk to Jennifer? Oh, they don't own a phone. Uh-oh. Oh my gosh. His whole, his whole call list. Let's see. Ivy. Coral. I guess he could call, he could call Coral. Just talk. Hey Coral, I apologize to uh, Mary Sue. I think we, we're friends again. Oh, I'm sorry for divorcing your daughter. Sorry, <laughs> sorry. Okay, let's fast forward. <coughs> I guess we could invite the oldies over. Then we could hang out and they could really become friends. Let's try calling Coral again. It's like, why don't you, did you just want to just come over? Uh, sure, your friend can come over too. I want to introduce you to my new wife. Oh, it's him. It's John, who doesn't have a phone. Oh, I need to just greet everybody. It's raining outside. Uh -huh. All right, so we need to talk, hang out. Probably the fastest way to become friends. All right, it's growing. Gosh, she is very dedicated. She just keeps going. She's not she's not stopping yet. Oh, she didn't quite make it. She didn't quite make it to finishing uh learning the fire prevention. Almost. Almost. Uh there it is. Fire safety. you make friends yet? No, but you're very close. You'll make friends soon. 
There we go. He made a friend. So she counts as a family friend then, so that's good. Oh, he wants to make another friend? Where's the where's the burb guy? He's probably hanging out in the hot tub. I knew it! I knew it. Um, so let's go hang out with him. Go hang out with him. <clears throat> so John and Jennifer Burb, they're they're related, right? Like they're related. Yeah, that's his sister. Jennifer Burb is um Daniel Pleasant's sister. That's his brother in law. Yay. Okay, what else do you want to do? Okay, you want to meet someone new as well. Well, why don't you say hello to uh, Coral here once she's off the toilet? <clears throat> you know, I, I bet I know. He must keep rolling the friends once because he has, he has such a big need for friends with his career stuff. Uh, okay, you can go talk to her now. All right, now she met someone new too. Um, she wants to gain a skill point. So charisma and creativity are what she needs for that job. Why doesn't she practice speech then? Actually, before she before you do that, girl, you need to probably eat some food. You're kind of hungry. Yes. Oh, she's about to go to work too. How you doing over here? Y'all friends yet? Nope. But you're getting there. You can come practice your speech while you wait for... Oh, nope. It's time for work now. Why is she look dejected? Why is your head hanging down, Kaylin? Why are you walking like that? All right. Come on, you guys. You can be friends. I believe in you. Hey, there we go. All right, we need to take care of his needs. <clears throat> hey, I know I have guests. I'm sorry. But I gotta, like, handle some business. Alright, take a shower. Alright, now you can go join everybody in the hot tub. Get those relationships a little bit stronger before it's time for bed. Alright, you guys. Say goodbye. Time to go. Say goodbye. Time to go, you guys. It's bedtime. All right. Bye, John. Bye, Coral. Thanks for coming to hang out today. It was really nice seeing you guys. I'm glad we can still be friends. Um, John, of course, I knew you'd still be my friend. You understand. Uh, Coral, I'm glad we can still be friends, even though I divorced Mary Sue. Um, I'm really glad for that. <clears throat> uh, she's home. Hey! Sweet. And she got a promotion. Okay, let's see if we can get her to take a shower before bed. See if she's like her energy is too bad. Is she gonna make it or is she gonna pass out? She made it! Yes, she made it into bed. Sweet. Yeah, I know tinkering's your hobby. I know. Oh, Daniel's up. What does he want? Go to work. Okay, yes, it's your it's a work day. Wants to make a friend, go on a date. <clears throat> Earn a hundred simoleons, okay. Uh, 
Well, Daniel, it's seven in the morning. I don't think we can call anybody to try to make a friend right now. We're just gonna have to do that later. Kaylin, you've been sleeping. You didn't try a tinkering activity. What are you talking about? Gosh, we're gonna, let's get them an oven. There's so, so many things she can't cook because they ain't got no oven. Let's get them a good one. Yeah, this one. We'll keep it matching. There. Now she can make a lot more things. Yeah, let's make pancakes. Hey, go to work. Go to work, Daniel. What is he? Oh, he's an assistant coach. <clears throat> he wants to buy a car. She making the pancakes. Making bacon pancakes. Making bacon pancakes. Oh, she's still hungry. Why don't you... Oh, that's Daniel. Ha! Oh, she's not hungry. You can put away that. All right, so you're going to write a novel. Um, she loves paranormal, so let's write a novel about a ghost and um and a, a soccer player um and there's a mystery okay and then there's an injury oh no um but then but then let's see um but then there's a baby in the end yeah and let's see our cover is i guess this is a good cover for it okay there we go Hey, Daniel's home from work. You can eat some pancakes. Kaylin made delicious pancakes this morning. So soon. <clears throat> She's got to go to work. Oh, her fun is so low. Writing the novel is not increasing her fun very much. It actually is lowering it. Oh, no. Sorry, Kaylin. You're like so low on fun. You're going to work. And she wears her maid outfit to work. It's so funny. Why don't you put away leftovers? Gosh, he really wants to woohoo. Okay, and he wants to make a friend. Um, we are going to then invite over. We're going to invite over Herb Oldie. We've invited Carol last time and she brought John. Let's invite Herb and see what happens. Why are we mad at Dustin? Is it because he's dating, um, is it because he's dating Lilith? No, he's dating Angela. Dustin's dating Angela. Huh, I don't know. Anyway, let's invite over Herb. Herb is out working. Oh, sorry, Lilith. Sorry. Well, we know Lilith's home, so why don't we call Lilith? Hey, Lilith, you want to see my new place with my new wife? I think that would be good. We can hang out. <clears throat> uh, she says, fuck you. She said, fuck you and the horse you rode in on. Okay, we'll try somebody else. Gosh, poor Angela. She's still very mad. Um, okay. Or sorry, Lilith. Let's see about Angela. Maybe if we invite over Angela. <laughs> <laughs> She's waiting for the phone repair man. Fantastic. Sorry, my phone died. Okay, well anyway, let's try let's try Jennifer. Oh yeah, she doesn't have a phone. Is there anybody else? Who else can we call? We've got Ivy. I guess we can call Ivy. Um, let's invite Ivy over. <laughs> one no, oh no. Oh no, okay. Um, shoot. 
What are we gonna do? What are we gonna do? Why, um... Let's see. Is there a gym we can go to? Can we go to the gym? Does Blue Water have a gym? Furniture, general store, arcade. Does downtown have a gym? Do, 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 do. Not really. Games gone wired. Okay. Bowling. Bowling, bowling. Um, we could go to. Woodland Park. Let's go to the roller rink. Why don't we go to, let's go to the roller rink. Let's go to the roller rink. We'll spend our evening there um, since Kaylin is working evenings. <clears throat> we'll try to make a friend. Find somebody to hang out with. Since everybody's apparently too busy or doesn't like me anymore. I can't imagine why that would happen, Daniel. Why doesn't anyone like you anymore? Is it because you cheated on your wife and uh, then you went and married the girl that you cheated with? Is that what happened? Okay, he's still got the make a friend. Let's see, who's going to show up? Here's Kenny. Let's greet Kenny Cox. Who else? Florence De La Rosa. Maybe he can greet Florence. They all are, like, doing something. Oh, Chico Ramirez. Why don't you greet Chico? He's a blue water sim, I think. Oh, hey, it's Nina. Why don't you, why don't you hang out with Nina? Oh, he thinks she's sexy too. Um, that's something you and your wife have in common. Or you and your ex-wife have in common. Why don't you hang out with her? He's gaining some fame. Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, he wants to ask him on a date. Oh my gosh. Oh, hey, it's your daughter. It's your daughter. Maybe he can talk with her next. Repair that relationship a little. It's at zero right now. She does not care for him at all. <clears throat> not even a little bit. Okay, come on, y'all gotta be friends soon. Woo! Lightning! Lightning! There we go. Why don't you try um, talking to your daughter? He wants to flirt with Nina? The fuck, Daniel? Oh my god, we should have him do it though. We should totally have him do it. Hey, Lilith. Um, anyway, work's been going good. How are you doing? He's gonna do it. He's flirting with her. Oh, she's happy work's been going good for him. <laughs> okay, let's stop. Let's stop. Okay. Oh my gosh, and Coral's also attracted to... This is just so much. Let's look at him. Look at that swagger! Look at that swagger! Oh my gosh, Daniel. Gosh, he's still rolling all these wants for friends. Oh my god, he wants to dance with her. That's too far, Daniel. That's too far, okay? Oh my gosh, and she's attracted to... Why is everyone attracted to Daniel? Like, literally everyone. Everyone is attracted to him. Is she leaving? Is she leaving? Lilith, are you leaving? Yeah, Lilith. Okay. This is enough. Okay, stop, stop, stop. 
why don't you um hang out with uh why don't you hang out with Checo? Or Ramirez? You know, it's not saying hangout's an option. The chat's an option. What about smooth talk? Will that unlock it so that we can do a hangout? Uh, uh, uh. He says no. Oh, now we can hang out. There we go. I guess we just had to have a little interaction. Come on, Checo. We're going to be friends. Oh, that didn't work out. Um, I guess you can roller skate a little bit. What are you doing? Stop it, Daniel! Oh my word. Oh my word. What are you doing? But there must be a decoration out there that he's looking at. Okay, well anyways, you did make a friend, so you can go home. Oh yep, there's a decoration right there. I think at the end of this round, we should fulfill that. We should get um, Kaylin pregnant since she has the baby we want. I think that's what we should do to, at the end of this round. <clears throat> Ooh. As Kaylin researches conspiracy theories for the Daily Hemisphere, she uncovers a lead that hints at a plan that by the Department of Agriculture to ship mind control prunes to a supermarket patronized by various Sim Nation intelligence agency staffers. Oh no. Should she publish the story and expose the attempt by the DOA to control the SNIA, or instead sit on the story and search for more evidence before going public? Publish now! Publish now! Department of Agriculture agents sue the paper for libel, and the CIA detains the Daily Hemisphere's editor for exposing the ugly rivalry between the two agencies. Kaylin has... 375 simoleons docked from her pay to help cover the expenses of her fine. Oh my God. Sorry, Kaylin. Sorry, Kaylin. I thought we were going to, you know, the squeaky wheel gets, gets the grease. I thought we were going to, you know, be gutsy there. Ah, she has that Nina want still. My word, Daniel. You scoundrel. You scoundrel. <clears throat> we need to get Kaylin pregnant before you start fucking around. We really do. Sorry. Okay, and you can have some food, and then you can go to bed. Oh, Kaylin's home! Oh, and her fun is awful. You need to just watch TV, girl. You need to just watch TV. Okay. You can put away leftovers, and then here's what we'll do. You can go relax. Kaylin, why don't you take a shower? Your fun's not terrible anymore. And then you can also go relax. Daniel has a woohoo want. That'll that should make her fun shoot up. Then they can go to sleep. <laughs> this isn't their first woohoo. Ah. Why are we getting a cutscene? <laughs> we <don't laughs> <even know. laughs> on this. Whatever. That shouldn't have happened, but whatever. <clears throat> oh. 
That was a pretty good day for you, Daniel. Alright, you gotta go to work, friend. Get your ass out of bed. Get your ass out of bed. Time to go to work. Oh, you know what? He could have... He's, like, way high enough to get the career reward. There we go. We can get him that. <clears throat> there we go. That's nice. Wow, she's going to make the bed even though she really has to go to the bathroom. Kaylin, you are dedicated to cleanliness. Okay, let's get that fun up. Yes. She wants to buy a worm rat cage. She can't have a baby, she wants a worm rat. Alright. You do need some more charisma, but you don't have any wants for that. So, I guess we can buy her a worm rat cage if they really want one. Um, let's see. This is her, her, she's getting baby fever. She's getting baby fever. Is this the worm rat cage? No, that's the pet display. This is... Yeah, this is the worm rat cage. Okay. Yep, and she wants to get a worm rat. We're gonna stock the cage. What should we name our worm rat? Should we use, um... Jed's, we do have a name from Jed in there. Let's get this, let's get the red eye one. We do have a name from Jed in there. Um... Opening my request queue. Grand. Okay. I know this isn't our legacy, but we're going to use Grand. Here we go. All right. Now you can uh, fill his food dish and you can play with him. All right. Still wants a kitten or puppy. You should get dressed, though. All right, Caitlin. Now you're good. You can kind of do whatever you want for today. It's fine. Just let her. I'll just let her be autonomous. Oh, Daniel's home, and he brought a friend home from work. Amazing week. All right, you need to use the toilet. Oh, we need to pay our bills. Holy crap. I always forget to pay the bills in this game. I always forget to pay the bills. <laughs> All right, let's do uh, a hangout with my friend from work so we can actually become friends. What you doing, Kaylin? Oh, you're going to work. Okay. Hey, there we go. Now we're friends. Manual qu what? We just became family friends. How are we no longer fa What are you talking about? That was dumb. They were like friends, then not friends, then friends again. Well, let's let them hang out a little bit more so we can kind of solidify that a little bit. And do we have more pancakes? We do have more pancakes. Let's eat some pancakes.
she wants to be best friends, so I guess we can hang out a bit more. Okay, we got them to 100, so that's good. Alright, bye dude. It was fun hanging out with you today. We're pals now, right? Yeah, pals for life. Oof, we need to clean that toilet. Alright, so we are gonna... We need to wait for... When does Kaylin get home? Gets home at midnight. We're going to try for baby when she gets home. But I think this might be our last night, or we have one more day. I think this might be our last night. Okay, she's home. You go relax in bed, too. All right, here we go. Try for baby. She's going to... She can wow. Y'all can't hear it, but Queen just snored really loud. <laughs> okay, let's see if we hear the chimes. I didn't hear any chimes. Didn't hear any chimes. We're going to try again in the morning. Oof. Kaylin, you gotta pee. Not you. Come on, Kaylin. You should really go use the bathroom. And then you can go back to bed. Okay. Let's try again. See if we get chimes this time. Alright, Daniel. Really, really want a baby. I really want a baby, okay? Chimes! Yes! Okay, she's pregnant. She's pregnant. Okay, y'all can sleep now. <clears throat> Yay! Okay, and it's winter. Okay, it's winter. All right. So, that is the end of Daniel's round. He, uh, he realized he has a thing for Nina who is uh, Mary Sue's new wife. Okay, he's trying to repair some of his relationships with his old family, um, but he just can't help his playboy ways. Uh, him and Nina, um, they're are like kind of flirty, right? Him and Kaylin, they're married. They have a baby on the way. I think when we play them in their next round, we're going to try to move them to a bigger house. So let's save and let's go back to the neighborhood. So they've got 26K right now. They've got 26k. So where could we where could we move them to? They need a house that's suitable to raise kids in. And where they are right now is just not. Like that condo, that's good for them, but it's just not. Okay, so we've got let's see, there's these there's this house right here. There's this house for 35 and this one for 28. Let's look at this house. Cuz I'll have to furnish it too. So I don't know. I don't know how that's going to work out. Yeah, because this house is not furnished. But it does have, like, a, a master. Kitchen is shit. We need to do some remodeling on this house for sure. But they could make it work. It's a single-story ranch that's got, like, you know, two two masters, effectively. It's about the three bathrooms got two masters plus this another room and I guess this could be like an office so like this could work this could work I think we might go for this house right here so that was um <clears throat> that was this one 170 sim lane so they would be across the street from the goths and then these and then these two houses are for sale get them out of the condo area but 
pleasant. There's the land grabs. Old Eva. What about this one for 32? What's this one? 190 sim lane? This one has a really large downstairs area. Way better kitchen. And then it's got effectively two big bedrooms upstairs. One that's just a straight up master with an ensuite and one where the bathroom has access for others. So this one is only the half bath. And this one is a full bath. Oh no, it's a full bath. It's got a shower. Just kidding. So this is like the master. It's got a cute little balcony. I don't know. Maybe this one's good. I guess I could cheat them a little extra money. Like they could, they take, they could take out a loan. They could take out a loan for the house. And then get this one. I kind of, maybe I like this one better. I definitely like the kitchen better. That other one, like only one person can be in the kitchen at once and it would be kind of annoying to go and get left, get like plates when they put plates on the counter. I mean, this house is a lot more expensive though. But maybe we'll move them into that one. Yes, we're gonna go ahead and end, end the game. All right. To those watching the VOD on YouTube, um, we're going to end here. Thank you so much for watching. And of course, as always, don't forget to make it a great day.